Right, I'm going to record a video that I wished I had like 20 minutes ago. So I've got uh, Eon Labs uh, mini moat. I'm going to force it into a reset by holding the bottom two buttons. All right, so that did a reset. And to pair it into to Open Hub, I'm going to join it to the Z Wave network here. And so I need to, from within the Hobman, uh, hit include and then tap join. One thing that I forgot to mention, uh, if you click onto a different binding and then back, uh, it will refresh your devices. So now I have node 33, which is my mini moat. And well, that kind of looks like something. All right, back to the instructions on the, the community site here. Looks like I need to hold the join button to wake the device until the blue light goes out. And hey, there we go. It does have more information in it. Let's flip into another binding and back to see if we have configuration yet. Okay, configuration parameters. Awesome. All right, so now we want to set configuration 250. We'll drop that down to scene mode. And I'll click off. It turns color. And then to get this to wake up and communicate again, I'll hold down join. Now it will talkity talk. I'll flip off to another one and back. Make sure that it did read. Hmm. Well, let's go back and watch this guy. Nope, still not showing, right? Guess I'll force another wake up. Come on, man, don't do me like that. Oh, hot damn. So it did take and it just didn't show that it did. <laughs> Fancy. All right, so the next thing we need to do is within the Open Hop Designer, uh, we need to create the button um, items. And I'm just gonna go ahead and save that now that I have my remote paired. And then we need some rules to go with that. Uh, specifically, the set of rules to turn those remote items back off because they're only turned on by the scene activation command from the remote. So we have to turn that back off in the virtual I or the items. And then a couple of different uh, rules here to, to do something with them. Um, so button one on the remote here, the upper left, uh, when it uh, turns to on in the rule here it will toggle my den light on and off and button two will uh, toggle the fan uh, high medium low off uh, in that order um, I will I will link those in the description uh, save that all right now that we have 
that working. I'm going to spin the camera on around here until we're looking at my, my den light. There's my ceiling fan up there. Hey, light's on. Hmm, something's broke. Oh, jeez. Yeah, there we go. It helps when you don't have typos in your item names. A little bit more about the switches I'm controlling in my den. I've got a GE12724 Z-Wave dimmer and a GE12730 Z-Wave fan control. And another example real quick. I've got button three set to toggle my Christmas tree. Merry Christmas. Bo humbug. 